brothers just uh, brother of the summit Hussein Arafat came from Syria two and a half years ago um, to settle here as a refugee. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala decides that as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَمَا تَدْرِي نَفْسٌ مَاذَا تَكْسِبُ غَدَىٰ وَمَا تَدْرِي نَفْسٌ بِأَيِّ أَرْضٍ تَهُوتِ That nobody knows what they will be earning tomorrow and also nobody knows um, which part of this earth they will pass away. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has decided that. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has decided the time. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has decreed for each and every one of us. And age is no concern to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Very young, age of 40, um, very healthy, but all of a sudden um, suffers a heart attack and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala decides to call him back. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi rajiun. That's what we say um, as a condolence for um, anybody. Uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that um, the people who bear this loss with patience, then give them glad tidings. That these are the people who bear it with patience. That um, who are the people who are the sabiri, that whenever some kind of musibah, whenever some kind of difficulty um, befalls them, then they say, Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raji'oon. Indeed, from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we came, and to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we must return. Now, as a community, our responsibility and our duty to the brother is to anybody that when they leave this world, then we have to um, prepare the janazah, we have to take part in um, doing the ghusl, the takfin, and, and the janazah. Uh, one of Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa in a hadith where he says that one Muslim brother has six rights over another Muslim brother. And one of them is ittiba'ul janazis. That when the janazah, when the janazah of somebody is announced, then you must follow the janazah to the grave. Then Prophet says that a person who attends the janazah of um, one of his Muslim brothers or sisters from the community, then follow qiratun min ajr. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give him one qirat of ajr. One qirat is um, a measurement. And the equivalent of that is to the equivalent um, of the Mount Uhud. And then when a person also takes part in the burial, then Prophet says that he will receive two kirats of ajr. So my respected brothers, um, the main purpose of janazah is that um, we seek forgiveness for the deceased. The janazah is seeking forgiveness for the deceased. That he's about to go for his final destination, um, he's on his final journey. From here, he will go into his qabr. In the qabr, he will be questioned. Before that, we seek forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the way we seek forgiveness is that um, we, when we are praying the janazah, the intention we make that um, we are praying this janazah for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to seek forgiveness for the deceased. And then um, the imam will say, um, when we've made this intention, we do the takbirat, the imam will say Allahu Akbar after the first Allahu Akbar, you pray um, Subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika wa tabaraka smuka wa ta'ala jadduka wa jalla tanauka wa la ilaha ghayruk and then surah fatiha and then imam will say takbir again after this takbir we pray durood Ibrahim like we do in salah and then the imam will say takbir again after the third takbir Allahu Akbar and we make dua maghfirat for the deceased اللهم اغفر لي حينا وميتنا وشاهدنا وغائبنا وصغيرنا وكبيرنا وذكرنا وأنثانا اللهم من أحيته منا فأهي إلى الإسلام ومن توفيته منا فتوفه إلى الإيمان If you don't know this dua, then اللهم اغفر له وارحمه وسكنه في الجنة Any other dua seek forgiveness for you Then the fourth takbir, after the fourth takbir, we do salam to the uh, right and then salam to the left And um, his burial from here will not be in this country. He will. He is being repatriated back to Iraq. So um, we will do Fatiha for him and um, seek forgiveness for him. At the same time, I'd like to mention that um, Dr. Ibrahim Salah, his niece, sadly passed away while she was performing Umrah. What a blessed place to pass away. May Allah Subhanahu wa Taala grant her forgiveness as well. Yeah. Inshallah, at the same time, we'll make du'a and for her. Yeah. So if you make the